Hi everyone, hope you're well. So today is just going to be a video on the Perfect Atkins Su Radiant Skin Protector. Uh, I saw this on TikTok, so I was going to be videoing them wearing it. Um, and they were wearing it as foundation. And I really did like how it looked, a really glowy effect. And um, now it is a really quite sheer um, formula. Um, so if you do need to to cover a lot of things, conceal a lot of things, it may not be right for you, um, but it does give it an amazing glowy effect, so keep watching to find out. This is what it looks like, um, so you can see it's very luminous, very luminous sort of finish to it, um, but when I did apply it, I didn't notice any obvious glitter specks, which I absolutely hate. How it looks after just one application you can see how glowy it makes my skin look i'm not gonna put foundation on top because um, i tried it yesterday for the first time and i didn't really need it um but i am still gonna apply concealer uh, because it doesn't as i said it doesn't cover any real blemishes or anything like that so i am using rimmel's multitasker concealer and this is in shade light Highlighter is Ritual de Fuel Siren. It's like a gold, sheer gold. Eyeliner I am using as Shine Pro Precision Waterproof Liquid Eyeliner. Um, I really like it. It applies a really precise line. Um, it's just it's waterproof. It's not, which is a little bit annoying, but um, it still lasts most of the day. The color I'm using is uh, Benefit Fan Fest, so it's a new mascara. I'm saying a massive fan. So I'm actually doing a review on my blog, let's think of makeup.co.uk if you want to have a look. But it literally is legendary, like most mascaras promise false lashes and they don't really live up to it as I'm sure you know. But with this, it pretty much does a really good job of almost getting there without wearing the real thing. So um, normally I can't sort of see this eyelashes um, in photos because the mascara is not that great. But with this I can actually see it and I highly recommend you buy it. did a review on that on another video if you want to check that out finally for lips i'm using the wonder bleeding lip mask in romance but if you've heard of these but it's basically like a lip tint um, so you put this uh, product on and then you wipe it off and then you get the remaining tint 
um, at the end it had amazing reviews on Facebook so I bought it um, initially wasn't overly impressed but um, obviously you know, I'm gonna give it another go because I only tried it once um, so let's have a look So the main issue I had with it was that it appeared quite patchy um, because it can seem quite thin on some areas and it didn't like didn't apply fully so I had to buy a lot more product this time around um, but hopefully a more full coverage um, so as you can see I did take a few applications to get this so I'm just going to let it dry and then I'm going to wipe it off. After I've removed all the, uh, the dark blue bits, so you can see that it has some colour to my lips. Uh, definitely um, darker pink than they are normally, um, but it's, it's not. Um, it's obviously not as bold as lipstick. It's quite a natural look. The Ekinsu Radiant Glow Perfector is available in six shades, from light, the very light, um, which is what I've got, to deep, um, so the dark brown. And obviously it promises to give you a raging glow, which I think it really does deliver on. So it does last pretty much all day. Um, you can wear it under a foundation if you prefer. Um, but um, I think it is perfectly decent to use uh, a light foundation um, without anything on top. Um, be really good for summer. Um, you don't need anything too heavy as well. It normally costs £16.95 on TikTok. Um, I'm not sure if it's ever available on boobs, it might have been. But it's currently £13.95 and there's only one shade that I'm out of, which is like a medium, medium deep or something like that. It's really comfortable to wear, it doesn't irritate my skin and um, I just love the glowy effect it gets me um, without having to wear anything heavy on top. Hope you enjoyed my review do let me know what you think in the comments if you've tried the product whether you recommend it or not and do keep coming back um, for the next video i'll see you next time